Hello YouTube, this is Christonian here and we are playing our new Amsterdam build here and we are still surviving. I've done a little bit of breathing to hopefully not have the same thing we had with Wayward. I think my mic was just too close to my face or something. For some reason it was over zealous on being gentle. So we have a list of things here from our comments. We have a smooth stone and carpet that we have to establish. Uh, we also have uh, batteries which are already started and dump zone. Our dump zones are full and that's why they're not cleaning up our battle zone. All I want is uh, a perimeter that the raiders that come in cannot reach us. Also, this happened on our last playthrough. Right when I finished the recording, a thing came up, and I clicked on it, and I saw that it was Raiders. I just didn't know how many f came in. Oh, this might be the end of this one, too. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Did I put... Yeah, we have some defenses around there, but I don't know if that's enough. So we have 13 there. How many citizens are we up to? We're actually up to like six now, which is nice. Uh, another trick I heard was in the comments. They said if you want to abandon your base, but with only one entrance, that's not going to help. If you want to abandon your base, you can go up in the corner and the raiders will give up and then you can come back and uh, salvage your base over time, which is not a bad idea. So, right now that's the only defense, so it might not be too bad. These guns just might open up and... And if I survive this, maybe I'll make a second wave. Please post. See if you like that idea. Uh, also, I wanted to say that I do have the new build that he talked about on Kickstarter. And I just wanted to know what your guys' decision was on what do you want to play? Do you want me to start the new build? Especially if I die right here. Um, other things uh, that we could do is uh, finish uh, Colony 6 and go to the new build with that. And we could have two combat builds at once or something like that. That's not too bad either. There's some iron there. That'd be funny as a little outpost or whatever that people are talking about. There's metal there. So we'll speed it up a bit. Bring it up to two times speed. Just looking for metal. And I didn't make that extra dump zone, so they won't go outside, so that's good. A lone beef muffalo, or beefalo. Yeah, Buffalo has gone mad. Oh, look at that. They don't take care of themselves anymore. Yes! Go, Buffalo! Go! Go! No, Buffalo! No! Mass gang shooting. <laughs> of Buffalo. And the end begins. So let's start up. I'm gonna say... Should I turn them all on? I guess it could be a test. We could see how much it actually takes power-wise to run this. And I want to go here, buildings, batteries. That's a lot of metal though. Hmm. We'll cancel about half of them. Just so we have a decent amount. Just in case we have to... Yeah, let's wait. Because I want to replace my turrets and my defenses as soon as possible. Uh, chase our M16. So we're going to militarize him. We'll put him out here for now. And then we'll decide where we want to go. Shotgun. Actually, 
let's not. I'm gonna go like that. Go like this. And not militarize them. We're gonna leave them be. Go, baby, go! And we're going to... <laughs> There's like squirrels. <laughs> uh, unforbid these just so we don't get guys running in there. So we lost two turrets. We're gonna get Smith over here. So he's our shotgun guy. We'll get him there. Get our M16 over here. And we're gonna let everybody go. <laughs> I like that death trap. You see the fire they get? BAM! <laughs> the death! The death zone! That is what I call it. Okay, so pause that. We're gonna militarize that. Bring them over here. And you're already military. So there we go. We didn't lose our turret, which is nice. And I'm gonna move everyone here so you can unmilitarize. I'm going to forbid these two. I'm going to. Ow, oh, what are you doing? Yeah, draw him in. Dry man to death. So who do we have here? Put this person over here and we're gonna play everything. There we go. Gonna send Johnson in to get a new prisoner. Yes! And we did it! Look at that people! Sixteen! Sixteen, I tell ya! Couldn't even make a dent. So we're gonna unforbid, or nope, unrecruit, and we're gonna unforbid these, and <laughs> look at the loot! Look at the loot! We're gonna have guns forever! Ah, too many boom rats and stuff in the way. Unforbid those, unforbid those, and we're gonna have to make a massive expansion to our graveyard. And we gotta go architect. Uh, bum, 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 orders at home. There. And that's it for now. I just wanna make sure, yep. And I'm going to send. Wake those guys up. Oh, and he died along the way. Too bad. <laughs> Bled out. The con artist. Oh, he would have been a good addition to the team. Would have, uh... Would have given us, uh... A good socialite for uh, converting. Okay, so now we need some graves. I'm gonna let them take care of the fire first. Because that's pretty uh, important. Okay, so that's done. Let's do door, door, door. And then furniture. Just so if there's any, if that's part of the programming in the background, there's more than enough to say that there's enough spare beds. Okay. So I don't think that's even going to be enough, so we're going to have to go even uh, more graves. Uh, buildings, I believe. Yeah. 
Huh. Certain terrain you can only build on. The mass graveyard begins. Okay. I was thinking maybe putting another turret over here. But that's too close to these walls, and if I blow the structure, then... Look at the weapons! Tons of pistols. A Lee rifle. Awesome. And like I said, I'm gonna try a second wave of weapons, I think. With our new build. Okay, now I'm gonna shut these babies off. So double click on them. And then G. Whoa! Gotta watch that. Another fire here. Orders, home. And just to make sure, we want to make sure that's in the home zone still. And it looks like it. So we survived and we didn't even lose one citizen. Bam! We lost a lot of metal because that's like a ton of metal. There's 150 metal each time for one of those things. One of those turrets. Mass graveyards! I should line it actually at the front so that they don't have to carry the body so far and it gets uh, prioritized and it gives it a badass feel the mass graveyards of death ah that's what I'll do I'll dig this out and then I can put more turrets back there yeah yeah nah, I got other stuff to do Okay. It's already starting to haul in the metal. And we'll call it an episode here. We've made it. We're going to have some people freaking out because they're seeing so many dead bodies. So that's going to have to be done soon. And we're also going to have to make an equipment area. just because uh, we need it. So I'm gonna establish that before we call it an episode. I'm just gonna put it all over the place. So furniture, equipment. One, two there, one, two there. And that should be good to go. So this is Christonian here playing New Amsterdam. We survived a onslaught of probably 13 to 16. I hope I counted them when uh, we're doing looking at the squad there before we had the attack of the muffalo. A very interesting episode. Thanks for coming by and see you guys next time. Bye! And as always, please feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and share guys. See you guys next time. Bye!